We're following a breaking news alert now. A global tech outage causing disruptions all across the country. Blake Eason is at the WKRN.com alert desk with a look at what we've learned about the impacts in Nashville. Hey, good morning to you, Nikhil. Yeah, so as the minutes go by this morning, more and more people are beginning to become affected from major internet issues to widespread delays and cancellations at airports all across the country. So here's what we're learning right now this morning. Cybersecurity firm CrowdStrike says they're behind the outage. They add that this issue is not believed to be a security incident or a cyber attack. But still, the issue creating a ripple effect really all across the country this morning. Media outlets off the air, banks offline, and flights grounded at airports all across the country. So let's look at Nashville right now. Nashville International Airport certainly feeling the effects all morning long. On the big board right now, 31 delays and four flights are being canceled. While the airport remains in service this morning, BNA is asking you to contact your airline specifically before arriving there to catch a flight today. Nikhil? Thank you, Blake. And we're seeing impacts in local government as well. Public services, utilities all happening this morning. Here in Davidson County, the jail report system was down overnight, but back online by 730 this morning. In Williamson County, the Office of Public Safety warned about disruptions for some public facing services. The city of Tullahoma warning about the same thing as well. The Paris Board of Utilities says they are unsure about any credit card payments, but the office did open at a normal time. And we heard about problems at the state level as well. Specifically Specifically, driver services centers may be unable to take payment and process transactions. The Department of Safety apologizing for the inconvenience. People out early this morning working in Middle Tennessee also seeing the impact as well. We spoke to a delivery driver named Karen Demore in Wilson County. She had a delivery to make just before 3 o'clock this morning and needed to find gas to make the 10-mile trip. With groceries needed to be delivered, she ran into some problems at multiple gas stations. I'm like, okay, fine. Okay, not gonna panic yet. So I went ahead and I pulled out a different debit card and I tried that one. Same thing, authorizing, 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 spit up a different receipt, same message. And I'm like, okay, this is weird. This is not right. So I left because I'm almost panicked. Now, eventually she did find that gas, but she says she also stopped by a number of convenience stores that didn't have working pumps or couldn't sell anything at all. Karen told us it was unnerving, not knowing what was going on and not knowing how she would make that delivery. It wasn't just about me. I had somebody else waiting for me at 2.30 in the morning. I mean, seriously, something she obviously really must have needed at, at that time of night. So, um, yeah, it was it was really crazy and insane. I had no idea what was going on. Karen told us it wasn't until she got home and turned on Good Morning Nashville that she learned what was actually happening. We're also monitoring the impact on early voting all across the state of Tennessee. Here in Davidson County, the administrator of elections says there are no issues. Early voting sites are open until 530 in the Nashville area today. At the state level, the secretary of state's office posted uh, the online voter registration is currently unavailable because of this outage. Charitable findings and the business services call center are also in accessible. We'll have more updates within the hour on the massive global computer outage, so be sure to download our app for the very latest information right at your fingertips.